this Sunday, Turks will be voting in a pivotal election. Recep Tayyip Erdogan, the Turkish president, has held a firm grip on power for over 20 years. Now, for the first time since he was elected president, the opposition has a genuine chance to oust him. His main rival is Kemal Kirishteloglu, a 74-year-old career bureaucrat. His opponents say that he lacks the strongman charisma of President Erdogan, but over the past couple of months, he has managed to bring together a broad coalition spanning from moderate Islamists to the pro-Western left that has set out to oust the Turkish president. Recent opinion polls show Kilis Telolo leading the race with a small margin of votes. Erdogan has seen a decade of strong economic growth in Turkey that brought millions out of poverty. Now, this time, it is the economy that is dampening his chances for re-election. Erdogan's unorthodox economic policies have led to runaway inflation and a cost-of-living crisis. And now his supporters are turning back on him just because of this. Erdogan's popularity was also dented by the devastating earthquake in the country's southeast in February that claimed over 50,000 lives and exposed the government's failure to provide a rapid and adequate response. Erdogan has been desperate in recent weeks to win back his vote. Quite recently, he announced that every household in Turkey is going to get free gas for a whole month. And just earlier this week, he announced a 55% raise in wages for all public sector workers.